westbound only. Meanwhile, on the road at Blackwell Tunnel, there are queues building northbound. That's towards the tunnel. Meanwhile, the M25 is slow clockwise around Junction 24. That's at the Potter's Bar. That's them following a breakdown. And the A13 has the usual traffic in the mornings building into town from Raynham towards Dagenham. OK, that's the travel. Let's see how the weather's looking. Here's Sara. Good morning to you. A fine start this morning if a rather cool autumnal feel out there, but plenty of sunshine to start your day. Later there, I think we will see an increase in cloud. That's because we've got some rain to edge in for the night tonight. But as I say, it is a fine day. We've got high pressure and control of our weather. That normally means fine weather and certainly for the day today it does. But as we go through the day, I think the winds will be a bit of a feature, slightly sharpening these temperatures at 15 or 16 degrees. Now, I mentioned some cloud moving towards us later. Is this frontal system just sinking its way in from the north and with that a real squeeze on these isobars, these white lines and that suggests windy conditions. So an increasing cloud through this evening but we're dry until the early hours of tomorrow morning. A bit of rain to come in by first thing tomorrow. The temperatures though holding up with that wind and rain but it is the wind I think you'll really notice through tomorrow morning's commute and as all that rain sweeps away yes the sun comes out but the northwesterly wind will again take the edge off these temperatures 16 or 17 degrees with some sunshine. A lot of fine weather to end the week. Friday looks nice and settled. Some good spells of sunshine. I think there we will see rain on Saturday afternoon. Well, that's it from me. I'll be back with more from BBC London News in around half an hour. Now, though, back to Louise and Charlie.